Hey everybody, how's it going? Uh, don't mind me, I'm probably rather loud, uh, just because the microphone is right here. I'm not going to touch it, because that would suck. But, um, how's it going everybody? Uh, ignore the mess in the background. I just got a new sword that came in, can't really see it because it's dark, but I just got a new greatsword that came in, so everything's kind of a mess behind me. But, um, how's it going? How's everybody doing? Um... So, let's just go ahead and cut to it. I was in the middle of uh, pr of editing a Spiral Scouts video um, before I realized I have to start getting... Oh, shit, I have to start getting ready for work soon. Mm. But I was in the middle of editing a Spiral Scouts video, and um, I don't know why, but for some reason I was like, huh, I need to... Uh, I just want to check to see... Because for the past couple of days, I've been wondering, hmm, is there like a pre-download thing of available for Sekiro, even though I can't play it yet because it hasn't been released yet, but is there like a um, like a pre-download I can do? So every day, I've just kind of been checking if there's a pre-download. Uh, turns out there was one today, the day before it officially releases. And I had been thinking, hmm, when does it actually release? So I know it releases tomorrow, the 22nd of March. But I was more so looking at what time, because I didn't know if it dropped at midnight, where it w would officially become the 22nd, or if it would be like at 6 in the morning, or 10 in the morning, or even closer to midnight of the 22nd. I didn't know, and so I decided to look up, I never found a definite answer, but I did see a lot of, a lot of places saying that it'll most likely drop at midnight tonight, where it would officially become the 22nd, in which it would be available for game, for playing rather. And I decided, huh, okay, and so I looked at my phone, looked at my schedule, my work schedule for the following week, and uh, I don't work until 4pm tomorrow, so I was thinking it would be pretty cool, it would be kind of fun to have a midnight stream with Sekiro, and I would go out and play that. Now, this is midnight at Pacific Standard Time. So, 2 o'clock in the morning for Central, and then uh, 3 in the morning for Eastern, off of the East Coast in the U.S. So, I decided, sure, we'll go ahead and do that. So, I'm doing this kind of update video to let you know, hey, pretty much, I'm going to be on Twitch, I'm going to be doing this, and that's pretty much what this video is mainly about. It's going to be really fucking awkward if it turns out that it doesn't actually drop tonight at midnight, but rather tomorrow at midnight. I know it's confusing because tonight at midnight is tomorrow at midnight, but it's just it's just weird. But I'm hoping that it'll drop at 11.59 with 59 seconds and, you know, 0.99. You get it. I hope it's going to drop to where I could play it tonight. So that way I could stream it. And it's going to be interesting because in all the Dark Souls games, I've never... Dark Souls 2 is the only one where I kind of did it. But in all the Dark Souls games, I had never actually done a fast-paced ninja build ninja build i've only ever done strength strength build has always been my thing which from i don't know much about the game i've been kind of avo avoiding as many trailers as possible i know that you have an arm or there's a grapple hook there's a shield a hand axe fucking uh, uh cherry poppers cherry fireworks pop the cherry i'm not sure exactly what that uh firework thing is that you throw out but I know that that's that. I don't know anything about the story or anything. I've been trying to avoid the trailers, <clears throat> so I have no idea what to expect. From what I can gather, though, it only looks like you have one weapon. I don't know how the upgrade system works. I don't know if there are any other weapons you can get, but it looks like you only have the one katana. Uh, I do know that there's no multiplayer, which is unfortunate because... I mean, PvP was kind of my thing. PvP was kind of my thing in Dark Souls, because I can only play the game so many times, I can only do so many different builds before I get run out of it, and I've never had a character on Dark Souls where I've only done PvE. I've, on every single character, done PvP. So it's going to be interesting to see how this, I look really pink, don't I? Now I look blue from the screen. Really should have, I look like a ghost. I'll look pink, fine, that's fine. Um, unless, for back and front, yeah, no, that's not happening, <laughs> anyways, fucking sorry, freaking sorry, um, it's gonna be interesting to see how well they do just campaign, because the campaigns for the Dark Souls games in the past 
have been really vague and have been subtle and haven't exactly been like in your face this is what's happening um so it's going to be really interesting to see them ditch out one whole mechanic of pvp and see how well they execute the campaign portion of it because i like story story is one of my favorite things in the game dark souls may be the only exception where it's the only game where i don't care about the story i still do it's still fun to know about but dark souls is meant for battle but for Sekiro, I'm really hoping that it's not... Because I don't think it's going to be an ongoing series. I think it's a standalone game. So it's. I'm hoping, really hoping, that they have a story that is obvious and that it all wraps up at the end where a lot of stuff isn't left open or left up to interpretation like the Dark Souls series was. I'm really hoping that in Sekiro they really, really nail down that this is a story game. There's no PvP. It's a combat game. But it is for the story as well. And I, I hope that they end up executing that well. Uh, but I'm going to go in. I, I, I'm going to head out. I'm not going to sit here and talk about what my hopes are for the game. Because I'm going to have fun with it no matter what. Uh, but I'm excited to see how much I get my ass kicked. When I'm doing a whole different style of gameplay. Uh, which is fast and quick paced. Which, that's Dark Souls inherently. But I've only ever done Strength. I think I already said that. This is the second time I'm recording this because the first time I was doing a whole different like audio setup and stuff and seeing if I could get a stand for my Yeti. Sorry about that. Um, turns out it didn't exactly work. So now, uh, now I'm just kind of... My Yeti wasn't plugged in when I recorded it the first time. And so uh, now I have to go ahead and do it again. But that's fine. That's fine. Um, but yeah, this will... It obviously isn't going to be this close for next time. I just haven't put things back together yet. And I probably... There's my alarm start getting ready for work. Thank you. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and call it there. So uh, thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to start uploading this. And hopefully it uploads by the time I leave my house. So it really fucking sucked if it didn't. But uh, night guys.